Hi everyone, what's going on? It's Natalie here, back with a message for you guys today. Hope everyone is doing well. So we're going to tap in and see what Spirit has for the collective for this reading. Keep in mind, energies can be reversed, time is fluid. Not everything will resonate for everyone out there, so please use your discernment, okay? Let's see what's going on with energy, Holy Spirit, and angels. What's the message for my collective in this reading? All right, so we got luck here, jackpot, fortune, and reward. Let's see. Looks good so far. Vow. Okay. Wish, hope, and worship. So whatever you pray for, you're getting it. As soon as you get it, pray too. That's also what I'm getting. Don't just pray for things. You pray after you get things. That's also what I just heard. So as soon as you get it, you've already prayed for it. So as soon as you get it, you get back on your knees and pray again is what I just heard. Because this is like, this is definitely something from the higher ups. Whatever this is. Okay, yeah, okay, you're going to be okay. Stability, harmony, and acceptance. Something's going to pop up to where you're just going to be okay. And you know it came from God, so you're good. You got introvert in the reverse. Online community, separate privacy. Hmm. We got the golden mirror. The narcissist love bombing, self absorbed, one sided. Whatever um, new thing that's coming into your life, you won't be able to hide it. Okay? It's just going to be there. Like, you can't hide a new car, you can't hide a new house. Whatever you're getting, it's you can't hide it. So it's not like one of those blessings that will um, that you need to keep to yourself. It's like you can keep it to yourself, but it'll eventually come out. Someone is trying to say you're a narcissist or something. What else? Yeah, camera in the reverse. Reminiscing, making memories, learn from the past and perception. Whoever thinks that you're a narcissist isn't learning their lesson. Okay, they're not understanding that the reason why they're the reason why you're getting blessed is because i don't know maybe for some of you guys whatever is happening here it's happening in front of their face because they try to stop you okay yeah we got robbery here with confinement someone may actually go to jail for theft while they're playing around they're trying to survive and compromise with you because they don't want to go to jail yeah so whatever you're getting is definitely coming from the higher ups or you're getting some sort of upgrade here you're going to be so happy when you get it you're going to do nothing but thank God, thank God, thank God. Like I'm getting, you guys are going to be speaking in tongues. That's how elated and um, grateful you'll be when it comes in. And someone else over here is going to be like, oh, well, you're a narcissist because no, no one's a narcissist. There's sometimes God blesses you in front of your enemies. And that's what this person needs to see or understand. Yeah, the Queen of Pentacles in her reverse. Someone may be stuck with somebody here and they're mad at you because they're stuck with this person. Or there's a female here that's stuck. She's mad at you because she can't. Or someone's a thief or something. There's thieves. I'm picking up thieves today in this, in this reading. Let's see. What's going on? Five of Wands reverse with a page of cups. Hmm. Now someone's like, oh, let's be friends or something like that. I don't want to fight with you. I want to enjoy what you got going on with you. Yeah, if you look in, the, in these two pictures, there's someone with the person that won. Two of Wands reverse. Five of Pentacles reverse. For some of you, you and your person, if you are married or you you know that you're with your person, you guys are together, you guys are going to be happy with this news that comes out. For some of you, this is just you experiencing good news by yourself. Yeah, you're coming out of the cold. Someone has realized that they took the wrong path or they made the wrong plan or they did the wrong thing here. They made an uneducated, messy decision here. Meanwhile, you made it out of the Five of Pentacles, King of Swords.
the emperor. Okay, so I'm talking to a divine masculine here. You made it out of something. And everyone's going to try to be your friend. Eight of Wands reverse. Something here is backfiring, so someone wants to apologize. The magician. You definitely made it out of something. It's like a miracle has happened or something here. Or like you, you something here is manifesting you or what, whatever you're investing in, it's coming through for you. Yeah, five of cups is here. And the three of pentacles with the page of wands and the six of wands. You may also have like survivors. What's that called? Survivors guilt or something. Because you may be leaving people behind. I feel like you're a masculine that I'm, I'm talking to. You may be leaving people behind right now. And it's kind of causing people to like feel some kind of way about it. What's the five of wands reverse? Page of pentacles reverse. Crabs in a bucket. Con artist. You got some people around here that don't want you to want you to succeed. I'm tapping into a divine masculine. Yeah, definitely a divine masculine. The Hierophant reverse. Seven of Swords reverse. I'm picking up a group of people that are like, oh, you're taking us with you. And you're like, no. <laughs> Nine of Cups reverse. Page of Swords, Queen of Swords. You could be getting like um, advice, good advice, spiritual advice on how to handle something or how to do something. Yeah, so there's like a whole cult getting caught out here. A whole cult getting caught out here. What's the Two of Wands reverse? King of Cups reverse. Hmm. Who's the King of Cups reverse? Ace of Cups reverse. Yeah, so like whoever this manipulative, there's another masculine here. He's very manipulative. Okay, he's the one that went the wrong way. Okay, he's upset. He's jealous. Okay, he could come from a dysfunctional family dynamic. This is the person watching you uh, move forward here, gain your justice. Okay, so that's one story. But I'm also picking up a divine masculine here. What's the Five of Pentacles reverse? Ace of Swords reverse. What's the Ace of Swords reverse, Five of Pentacles reverse? Yeah, someone's like, they're in denial or someone hasn't figured out like what it takes to get out of poverty or like they haven't, yeah, Ten of Pentacles reverse. It's like someone's cursed with their money or something. Something about their money is cursed. The Queen of Pentacles figured it out. There's a female here that figured it out. There's a man, a man here that has not figured it out. So they're like trying to come up with all these weird scenarios as to how you got out of something or oh they sold their soul or oh they did this they did that and you did none of that what's the five of pentacles reverse i feel like you prayed and manifested for something and it's coming through for you yeah the three of cups reverse it's a whole group of people trying to get together and reason and figure out why you got out of something <laughs> they're not happy with this it's like a group of people try to like smear campaign you or like um you know just totally demean your character as to how you got out of something here what's the king of swords the king of wands there is a divine master out here though but it's not really picking up what he's doing it's just picking up he's here what's the king of wands with the king of swords High Priestess Reverse. Hmm. Nine of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, and the Devil Reverse. So if I'm not able to pick up on this Divine Masculine's energy, I'm probably not supposed to. But he's here. And he's making moves out here. What's the Emperor? What's the Emperor? There's also like a group of people that doesn't want someone paying attention to somebody. I don't know why I'm getting that. It's like, no, they're like, look over here, look over here, don't look over there. And this masculine is like, they're not paying any attention. What's the world with the emperor? 
Yeah, Page of Swords reverse. Someone's throwing evil eye. It's like they're trying to distract a masculine from looking somewhere. Justice could be a Libra. Yeah, definitely Libra energy. They're trying to distract a masculine. So I don't know what that's about. What's the Eight of Wands reverse? Or whatever this masculine is looking at, they're trying to see what this masculine is looking at and they can't pick it up or they're trying to distract them. We got the Four of Swords. Yeah, someone needs to like sit down and rest, meditate or something. There could be a masculine out here uh, denying calls. Like they're denying calls or like they're not answering anybody right now. What's the Four of Swords? So looks like this divine masculine's resting or something. We got the sun reverse and the three of swords, but someone doesn't like this. They feel rejected, they feel hurt and betrayed by this masculine, just simply not paying attention or just wanting to be on their own or by themselves. Yeah, this female here, she's stressed out. Hmm. I don't know if this is you stressed out that a masculine isn't paying attention to you or you can't figure out what he's doing, but uh, whatever he's doing, he's doing it to everybody. Four of Cups reverse. It's like they're not rejecting you. I feel like they're going to come back. But there's something going on with this masculine here. It's like he doesn't want to be tracked or something. He doesn't want... Someone that may have like turned off their notifications or something. So that like they get no messages. I don't know. What's the Five of Cups? Six of Swords reverse. What's the Six of Swords reverse? Five of Cups. The Nine of Pentacles reverse and the Nine of Wands. Someone has to hold up their lifestyle and it's really hard for them to hold it up. They don't know themselves or something. Whoever this woman is, there's a woman here. Six of Wands. Okay, so this woman's always paying attention to what other people are doing or... They want to be in the spotlight or something. They want to do what a Leo or a Sagittarius is doing. So, yeah, Seven of Pentacles reverse. Oh, this is this is going back to that group here. That group that's trying to reason as to why you got something and stuff like that. Yeah, they, they're making bad investments or they made bad investments or they feel like they wasted their life or something. What's the Three of Pentacles? Because you're working on something here. Knight of Wands reverse. What's Three of Pentacles, Knight of Wands reverse? Someone's really reckless. So if they're trying to do what you're, what you're doing, they can't because they're just too reckless. <laughs> yeah, I'm picking up multiple stories in this reading. The Four of Cups. Yeah, someone gets rejected when they try to do what you do. You got copycats somewhere. Because they're trying to come up with reasonings. Oh, the collective has this because they did this, this, or that. Or because they sound like this. Or because they look like that. That's the reason why they made it. I can do that. Anyone can do it. But come to find out, no, that's not it. They don't even know how to do something. Or with the Six of Pentacles reverse, no one's supporting them or something. They're getting bad news that the reason why you're doing something is because it's your calling. And they're going crazy. Oh, I want that to be my calling. It's like... No, your calling is your calling. So I don't know who that is, but I'm picking up like multiple energies here. Someone's going to try to say you're a narcissist because you got some sort of blessing that you prayed for. Something that was between you and God is manifesting in your energy. And someone is saying, oh, you're not really um, God-like or you're not really like they're trying to make it seem like you're not who you say you are or something and like no I am look I just got this thousand dollar check or ten thousand dollar check right when I needed it I'm also getting like something like when God blesses you it's not when you want it it's when you need it so if someone it's like let's say if you needed something paid off in like the next five days or something it's like you'll get a blessing between between now and five days or something like that to handle whatever you needed and you're like okay okay i'm good now it's like god blesses you um every step of the way 
which is why you're on his side. These other people like to rush their image or something like that. So they're definitely not godly people. They don't wait for God's uh, blessings. They don't wait for his signal, his sign to know that everything is okay to, you know, like something here. God is just good, okay? He's just good. He does things right on time, right when you need it. But look, we got the Queen of Pentacles reverse. There's someone here that just does not, they're not in that energy. They're more of a thief. Yeah, the Hierophant reverse. They have some sort of like cult-like energy going on with them. Yeah, four wands reverse, no stability. Someone here wastes all their money, don't pay their rent on time or something. I don't know. Page of wands. Three of Pentacles reverse. Nine of Pentacles is here. Someone keeps making the same mistakes over and over again. They're not learning. The Devil reverse, three of Swords reverse, the King of Swords. Okay. Let's see what else. Six of Wands, or the Six of Swords, and the Hermit here. Someone out here knows themselves very well. Someone is single, they know themselves very well. They could be a Virgo or have Virgo placements. But I'm really getting energy where like this masculine is trying to get away from somebody here. Somebody that does not learn from their mistakes or they don't know how to take care of themselves properly. This is also giving me Archangel Michael guiding you away from something here. While they deal with this party here or like something about oil and water. You just don't mix with this person. Yeah, the Queen of Wands is here. You do something a little bit differently than this person. This female here. Someone's more like a city girl. What's the uh, Queen of Pentacles reverse? They're like, they're a thief. Like, they just take other people's money. What's the Queen of Pentacles reverse? Two of Pentacles reverse. Mm. Something going on with their finances. Yeah, the, wheel, uh, the Chariot reverse. Something about a car, too. They're not handling something appropriately or something like that. What's the Four of Wands reverse? High Priestess reverse. This could be a dark High Priestess too. Not stable. Not following their intuition about their stability. Have no sort of foresight. No, no yeah, they have no sense of foresight. What's the High Priestess reverse with the Four of Wands reverse? Can't make it up. Very unhealed. Someone does not have their life together while they're being a High Priestess. Someone's trying to be a High Priestess, they don't have their life together. Okay, what's the three of uh, pentacles reverse? Seven of swords. Yeah, thievery, conniving. Be careful with this energy, guys. It's like someone isn't learning their mistakes. I don't know. They're, they're not learning from their mistakes or something. Seven of swords, three of pentacles reverse, strength reverse. They're always trying to find a shortcut. They don't know how to like build or something. Something is wrong with these, this person. They can't build or something. Yeah, judgment reverse. They're trying to do everything they can to escape judgment right now. Whoever this female is, it's like she's trying to like, she's always, she is getting, she is getting away with something here. But there's no progress in this person's life because they cannot, I don't know, something's going on with this person, man. They may need to surrender something. What's the nine of pentacles? The Magician Reverse, so they're throwing magic at whatever you're doing here. Wow. <laughs> the Lovers. Someone is like doing magic on your love relationships. Also, be careful getting love readings from people. Be careful getting love readings from people. That's what I'm going to say about that. Magician Reverse with the Nine of Pentacles. The Emperor. So I feel like I'm talking to a masculine in this reading. Ten of Wands, Ten of Cups, or I'm getting, someone is trying to throw magic at your emperor and he's already here or something, or he's already like 
in your life or whatever this is. What's the three of swords? The sun reverse. What's the sun reverse three of swords here? Someone just has a negative outlook on life because they wasted time or energy or money on something. I'm hearing a specific reader, but let me not, because I don't do that. I don't call out readers in my reading because I just don't do that. But I'm hearing a specific one and they wasted a lot of time, money, and energy on something. Bad investments. Page of Swords. Why are they looking at you? What's the Devil Reverse? Four of Pentacles. Yeah, someone is like tapping it, trying to tap into your energy here. Two of Swords, but they can't really find much. Yeah, someone's trying to tap into your energy and, and they're literally saying anything. Uh, Six of Pentacles reverse here. They're not getting what they want out of this. What is the uh, Six of Swords with the Hermit? I feel like you're getting away from these people. These crazy people. You're okay. They need to accept that you're okay. I don't know why they expect you to not be okay. Six of Cups is here. Seven of Cups reverse. Someone's delusional. Yeah, Five of Wands. They're trying to compete with you or something like that. Someone tries to get close to you to get energy from you so that they can use it against you or compete with you or something. And they know that you know... They know that you have a soulmate or something. Someone may have like a, had a dream about you or something. They had a dream about you avoiding something. So here they come trying to ruin it, okay? We have the full card here. It could be Karmic Aries or Scorpio. Yeah, someone's weird. Someone does not need to be in your energy. And for some of you guys, it's a reader. They're tapping into your energy and trying to do what? King of Wands. I feel like they're trying to tap into what this uh, masculine is doing. Or where he's going. Or where your masculine is going. For some of you guys... Your masculine doesn't know this person, your person, or yeah, your masculine doesn't know this person or something like that. But for some reason, they feel like they can block you from this person. I don't understand that logic, but whatever. Maybe they're trying to get close to you to be your friend and tell you to go the opposite way. Maybe they're trying to get close to your masculine and be their friend and tell them to go the opposite way. I don't know how they plan on doing this, but it's not going to work and they look crazy. Someone's trying to escape their own judgment, their own life. And I feel like they're nitpicking at other people's lives right now. And they need to be focused on their own life. For some of you guys, it's a reader. They're just doing the absolute most. Because they're not living right. It's some, something about like they're not living their life right. If they were living their life right, they wouldn't care about what other people do. But for some reason, because they're not living their life right, they're projecting upon, I don't know, the collective or you... You're not a narcissist. You're not reminiscing about the past. You're moving forward. Your blessings are not from the devil. They're from God. You know that because you waited patiently for it. It's like someone is trying to demonize you for uh, being successful. Yeah, look at this. Happiness hater. Someone's a happiness hater out here. They're saying because you got some sort of good luck and fortune. Oh, it was a fluke or I don't know. Every time I get more than 5k views on a video, I get attacked. It's like I'm not allowed to win out here. So I guess this could definitely be like platform energy. We got obsessive lover and threatening. Intimidating, threatened, and bother, bother, dangerous, toxic, unhealthy, possessive, and karmic. Yeah, someone is like a crazy person. And they're totally bothered by you. They're totally bothered by your love life. And for some of you they're you don't know this person and your person doesn't know this person yeah we have divine masculine here yeah someone's trying to figure out where this divine masculine is going hmm they're upset they don't like seeing this divine masculine happy or 
they try to demonize this masculine because he's happy or something. Yeah, jackpot, winning money, got rich, inheritance, unexpected money. Something unexpected happened for you or it will happen for you and they're going to be mad about it. Yeah, someone is running away from this crazy person. Hmm. Someone can, like, your blessings, it can be seen. Whoever's being blessed right now, it can be seen, obviously. it's It can't be hidden. Someone can see it. Yeah, we got clinging here. Holding on, obsessing, and spying. So I must be tapping, tapping into this masculine's ex here. Like, she's upset that this masculine's making moves or something. Clarify happiness, hater. What's happiness, hater? We got boss daddy here. Yeah, so someone's mad about a masculine here coming into some sort of money. Or they're mad that you are attached to this masculine. Or you're getting an offer from this person. Yeah. What's obsessed lover? <laughs> someone's obsessed. They want to know where they're at. Travel. Yeah, they're obsessed with where this masculine is going, where they're traveling to. Okay, yeah, they're thinking about this person, missing them, craving and desiring them. What's threatening? Realizations. Epiphanies, understandings, and awakenings. Someone is realizing this person is crazy, okay? Yeah, love triangle. Third party, multiple lovers, and choices. Mm. Wolves in sheep's clothing. Yeah, so someone is trying to pop up around your masculine and say, hey, what do you, like, how, are, where you been, or something like that. This could be like a, a masculine's old friend, or this is your old friend. It's like someone wants to be close to you so that they can be a part of your love triangle. What's divine masculine? Foundation, established family and security. So a divine masculine is stable. They found out that this masculine is stable, or that you have a stable divine masculine and they're broken. Shattered, heartbroken, and destroyed. I don't... Haunted. Memories, flashback, trauma, side effects. So someone is haunted because this masculine is stable or they don't want this masculine to uh, be stable with you because they weren't stable with them or something. They feel like they deserve that offer. Okay, whatever. What's jackpot? <laughs> always partying? What's always partying with jackpot? dirty offer yeah someone doesn't want the offer of someone that's always partying <laughs> someone only wants to party with somebody because they won the lottery or something yeah so they're shocked like oh no they didn't expect that so someone like won the lottery or they came into some sort of money or they came into some sort of like unexpected offer or you have and someone's upset that you don't want to party with them or share with them or something or Oh, drinks on you, and you're like, I don't think so, and now they're all shocked. <laughs> What's running? Conflicted. Decisions, hot and cold, multiple choices. Hmm. Finality. Farewells left behind in closure. Yeah, someone is running away from somebody that, like, they uh, give them hot and cold energy. They don't want to be around that person. Apology. So they're going to... They're going to, someone is running away from somebody here. They could be coming towards you and trying to uh, say sorry. Someone may have went around somebody and just paid for drinks. And they're upset by what happened. Because they found out someone was just a gold digger around them. What's moving? Like, whoever this woman is that they were with or... They may have, like, took someone out. When they won the lottery or something. And they didn't do anything with you. But they did something with a random stranger. And they want to apologize for that. What the heck? What's moving here? Yeah, it wants you back. Influences. Attachment, third parties, and peers. Exhaustion. Depletion, drained, and long journey. Yeah, someone wants to come back around to you. Someone's actually thinking about moving in with you, but I don't like, I don't know. Yeah, confusion.
be careful of someone coming back around to you because They're tired of like the streets or something, but they may go back out there. <laughs> What's clinging? There's some sort of obsessed female out here though. Pretend mass exaggeration. Yeah, someone's running away from this person. The one that's pretending. Yeah, they're uninterested in this person. The person that's obsessed and spying on them, they're uninterested in them. There's some sort of weird delusional female out here. She's upset. Whoever this woman is, she likes to party or she likes to use people for their money or something. And she's upset that this masculine didn't share with her or something like that. Or maybe he did share with her and he regrets it because it's like, you know, it was just a one-time thing or something. Okay, yeah. We got prosperity and abundance. Affirmation for positive change. So yeah, you guys are moving forward to prosperity here. You're sitting in your prosperity and someone's upset that you're not sharing with them, man or woman. I feel like there's a little bit of both here. Okay? So if you guys is reading, hope this resonates for you guys. If it does, go ahead and like, subscribe, share on my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.